Hi there, and welcome to my channel. I'm Liz, and today I wanted to kind of do a battle of the white t-shirt dress. <laughs> so I recently picked up, uh, or I did an Amazon white dress haul, and I'll link that here if you haven't seen it, where I just picked up uh, some white dresses from Amazon, tried them all on. Well, there was a few that I loved in there, and in particular, there was a white t-shirt dress that I loved everything about, but I didn't love the tone. So then I set off to scour the internet for the same dress, but in a different tone, and I could not find one in the whole World Wide Web, which is pretty unbelievable. Um, I found ones that had flutter sleeves and cap sleeves and V-necks and slits and no pockets and all these things, but I could not find a plain white t-shirt dress. So I decided to keep that dress and I then did a uh, lookbook. So I'll link that up here as well because I was like, well, if I'm keeping it, I, I want to have many ways to style it. So I did some looks there that you can check out and uh, came up with some great looks, but the tone was still bugging me a little bit. And so I decided, you know, I'm going to reorder it. Maybe it's just this one dress because I have gotten a dress that is just something is off or wrong about it. And it's just that one and you can reorder it and then it'll be correct. So I was like, maybe, maybe that happens. So while I was on Amazon, um, I, I just decided, well, let me, let me get a few more and see if I can find a better t-shirt dress because they did have some similar to that plain cut that I wanted uh, there. And so that is what this whole video is going to be on today. So I'm going to compare the white t-shirt dresses that I picked up and I did pick up a total of four. So the same one and then three others that were kind of a popular seller, I would say had a good amount of reviews and uh, I will let you know uh, how they fit, uh, the thinness uh, and all my thoughts on them. So if you're interested to see who has the best white t-shirt dress on Amazon, then just keep watching. And real quick, ladies, I wanted to mention, I do wear a slip under all my white dresses. I would recommend a slip or some type of shapewear. I don't prefer shapewear, um, so I just have a normal slip. I find it doesn't add heat uh, and it is comfortable and it just gives a better overall look. Okay, so let's compare, see if we can compare color differences. It's so hard, um, especially since I have colors on the wall. Um, I, I do wanna get a white room one day, but I, I don't have one yet. <laughs> um, they all look pretty similar in tone. I'm, I'm in front of the window. I don't know if you could tell. I would say the second and third are maybe a the third one, which is also a different material, is the brightest white. And the other three are pretty similar. I don't know if you can tell, it's hard. All right, the first dress up is one that I already own. So I did repurchase the second one, but for the price and in white, you know, totally fine. It's kind of like having an extra t-shirt, I think. <laughs> and so, yeah, I mean, I like this dress. It is just so comfy and classic. And the thing that I love about a white dress is you can just dress it up so easily. You could accessorize it. I think I've gotten used to the tone, I guess. Um, but in white, that is something to be aware of. So if you get a white dress and you're like, mm, I don't know about the tone or I don't know about it, um, it usually is the tone that is the issue. And so I do find too that a lot of the white from Amazon appears dingy. Like it's not like a bright white and I'm not sure why that is, but um, when it's all by itself, you really can't notice that. Um, it's more when it's next to other whites, but I mean, if you're wearing a whole white dress, what are the odds of somebody else with you wearing a whole white dress? Could happen, especially in the spring and summer. 
but it's pretty rare. And anyway, you know, if you have it all styled up cute, it doesn't matter. This one is a great closet staple in my opinion. Just a lovely, comfy, flattering fit. All right, and the second one I am reviewing is this V-neck or faux wrap top uh, white t-shirt dress from Lil Better. And it is thinner. Um, it's the only V-neck, so I just wanted to try it. It seems like really popular uh, cut, especially when you're looking off of Amazon but I kind of was looking more for the crew neck basic t-shirt look, but uh, this was just another one that I picked up, so I wanted to include it in here, and then you can kind of see maybe you only like V-necks. And so I would say the material is thinner. It definitely is even cooler, so I'm definitely getting like kind of a bluish tone, uh, and I am next to this dresser. I need a white room one day <laughs> to film in. But uh, even them next to each other, I could tell that this one, the color, the white is just a little different. But the arm length is pretty good. It has pockets. If you do like the V-neck, it does have kind of this belted area uh, that is a little different. So this one just is different than the other ones. Uh, not really, I guess not really a fair comparison, but it is just one that I had picked up to uh, consider and so I wanted to throw it in here and the length I would say is about the same so I would just say it's a little cooler so far and a little thinner in uh, material compared to the first which is what I'm going to compare them all to because that's my favorite find so far all right uh, this one is from Miss Faye and it is thinner um, more see-through, even less forgiving. I think you could see more of my rolls and I'm not a fan of shapewear. So I like a thicker material because I think that that kind of glides over any bumps and bulges a little nicer. So a real thin material just isn't forgiving for me. And so um, this one does have a higher neckline it does have a pretty good sleeve length. It is a little looser too. So if you like a little bit looser fit, um, I actually like the cut. This one's just too thin for me. That's probably what I like least about it. Um, the color seems pretty similar to the other two so far. So this is the third one. Right, and the fourth dress up actually is the most similar to the first one. It is a little thinner, still has the pockets. I feel like the top fits like the first one. Um, so yeah, this one, this tone is good. The length, the cut, the uh, crew neck is about the same. Uh, the sleeves are the same still has the thin belt line and this one feels really nice actually and I would say I, I'm just thinking the color and tone are all pretty similar I wonder if they come from the same place <laughs> so anyway this is dress number four all right ladies what did you think <laughs> was the battle worth it uh, am I just ultra picky <laughs> I think that overall front and back and cuts and everything, I think Seven Show is still my favorite and I will need to compare this one to my previous one. So I would love to hear your thoughts. And then another question, I am not real big on makeup, <laughs> so I usually don't know what I'm wearing, but I have been asked, so I wanted to include uh, usually I just wear lip glosses and I have the color uh, Sweet Mouth is the lighter pink for just a little bit of, um, you know, a light, light pink. And then the one I have on right now is called, I should have put glasses on, uh, Fenty Glow. <laughs> So uh, that's what I like to wear, just low maintenance. I'm a low maintenance makeup, hair, and clothes person. I like to kind of keep it simple and classic, 
uh, and comfy. So I don't like to wear a lot of makeup. I don't like to wear a lot of shapewear. I don't like to wear uncomfortable clothes or shoes or any of that stuff. So if that's you, then make sure you subscribe because that is the kind of clothes I'll always have on this channel. I don't like uncomfortable stuff. Um, so anyway, hope that you enjoyed this video and this battle of the white tee dress. <laughs> Um, if you did, be sure to like, and I thank you so much for stopping by. I hope that you come back by, hang out again, and I hope that you have a wonderful day. I'll see you soon.